Look at the eyes before and after. So here is an image I generated with Mid Journey and it looks pretty realistic. By the way, here is the prompt I used if you are curious. But if we zoom in on this image, there is basically no texture. So the image is very soft. If you look at the eyes or the eyebrows or even the lips, they started getting blurry and pixelated. So there is not much detail into that photo. And if I want to use it, for example, in editing tutorial like for a magazine I need a really high quality image so I've tested out quite a few upscalers and the one from Leonardo AI find link below it gives us pretty amazing results here is before after look at the eyes let me zoom in look at the eyes before and after pay attention to the eyelashes and the depth in the eyes and the eyebrows right here or even the teeth look at the teeth they basically have no texture before and after same with the lips so it gives you pretty great results and you have some options here that you can control you can even change the image by using a prompt and you have also this slider for creativity strength so if you notice she didn't have any moles before if you look closely here the ai generated that mole and some wrinkles as well i think it does pretty amazing job and you can also switch between styles here i have an illustration and it's really bad quality like we can see it's already pixelated and blurry and here's the before and after so this is a clean nice illustration that we can use even in print look at the hand it was super flat and now we can clearly see four fingers here and also what's great about this tool is that even on the free account you're getting like 150 tokens so they are pretty generous so you can upscale quite a few few images and then you can sign up for something symbolic like ten dollars and also they have different tools so this is just one of the tools of course they have image generation and they have also super interesting tools that i'm going to make videos about so that's it for today i hope you enjoyed this video and follow for more tips on graphic design and ai and i will see you in the next video